Hello, my name is Rachel and I love all things gothic. So I was so excited when I, I got an email in my YouTube email address account asking me if I wanted to review the Gothic Beauty Magazine quarterly subscription box. And here it is. It just uh, showed up like I think one or two days ago and uh, the, the rainbow sticker is me covering up my address but I'm so excited to get into this I didn't even know Gothic Beauty magazine well first I didn't even know Gothic Beauty magazine still existed because I did used to read it way back in the early 2000s I believe I would get it at um, Tower Records in Fairfax Virginia <laughs> I think that's where I would get it but I did used to read it and I didn't know that they were still around and I definitely didn't know that they had a subscription box. Now it is a quarterly subscription box and I will put down in the description and in this, <laughs> it's a quarterly subscription box and I will put down in the description <laughs> a, a link to the uh, website where you can order it. It's from a company called Zentastic. So let me just tell you a little bit about uh, Gothic Beauty Magazine, this box right here. Uh, Gothic Beauty Magazine was founded in the early 2000s and is the largest and longest running goth magazine in the world. Over the years, the magazine has covered all aspects of gothic culture, but with an emphasis on style, fashion, and makeup. Each quarterly issue is now released with the option of a gothic beauty box, which includes that quarter's issue of the magazine. Some subscribers only get the magazine, but you can also opt to get the beauty box. Uh, in case you're wondering, you can get a uh, e, e version of the magazine, so purely online for $8, or you can get the print version for $15. Or you can get this entire box for $45. <laughs> Some subscribers only get the magazine, while many opt for the Gothic Beauty Box subscription. The Gothic Beauty Box is curated to have a fun assortment of goth must-haves, little spooky luxuries, and new cosmetics useful for gothic makeup looks. So every box does come with that month's Gothic Beauty magazine. Let me open it up. Um, I've already undone the tape, but I haven't gone through it yet. I just did un I just undid the tape and then popped it open to see that right on top is a the Gothic Beauty magazine, which so pretty. And here's the back. And this is issue number 54, issue 54. And then uh, there is this, which I do believe tells you everything that's in the box. So we're not actually going to read that at this point. And this is what the box looks like. And this is like a beauty and lifestyle box. See what type of interesting and fun items that they send in this box. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, so we'll just start with the easy things, the stickers. Here is a Gothic Beauty Magazine sticker, and I really like that sticker. I do love Ankhs. And then this is, oh wow, it's a lip service sticker. That's cool. <laughs> I do love my old lip service pieces. Oh, and, and then here is a lip service postcard. So I guess that they are in cahoots with uh, lip service, because lip service does still exist as a site. They're just not as, they don't have as much as they used to. Uh, basically they now just have like their, their core lines, their original lines, but they do still exist. <laughs> Alrighty, let's start, let's see here, let's start with this. So first up here we have 3D skull ice molds. So this is to, uh, a ice cube tray to make little 3D skull ice cubes. And that is fun. And here is the mold. There's like little holes that you put the water in and then I imagine it just pulls apart when they're ready. So I'm excited about that. That's going to be fun to use. And let's see what else we have. We have some little purpley shredded paper thingies for pattern, uh, padding. What is next? Spooky Spirits Orange Clove Autumn. So this is like a perfume oil, I'm going to guess. And let's just open that right up. That smells... Oh yeah, no, that smells, that smells like the fall. Definitely smell those cloves. That smells nice. Yes, definitely. So got a nice little a body oil there. Oh, what's this? Concealer, soft matte concealer. A little concealer. <laughs> That's <laughs> cute. <laughs> Let's see here. Oh, it's got 
fun packaging. This has a, uh, let's say, dark, what does that say? Dark asteroid. And is it a cream? Yes, and it's a very white <laughs> cream concealer. <laughs> so I'm really curious about that. Huh. I definitely have to give that a try. I don't, I don't do well with concealers because I feel like they make my eyes look more wrinkled and crepey <laughs> than, than, than it covers to make it worthwhile. But, yeah, I am excited to try that. I wonder what this brand is. So it just says concealer. probably says on that piece of paper. Well, at the end, we'll look at the piece of paper and figure that out. Next up, we have a couple of jewelry items. So they, they kind of touch on everything here. We have this adorable little bat necklace. And that's super cute. And an adjustable ring. It's a cat. It's a little cat ring. <laughs> I'll show you here in a second. <laughs> but it is adjustable. So you can see it does bend. But it's a little kitty cat. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that there. The folks, yeah, there we go. Yeah, <laughs> how cute. <laughs> and then on this side where, you know, it, the, the, the split is, it's like little paws. <laughs> that is adorable. That is absolutely adorable. There we go. And I did make it big enough to fit. How cute is that? Let's see. Moving on. Uh, this is Lashy Doodle. Oh, it's an eyeliner stamp. Two-in-one eyeliner stamp, and it's a waterproof eyeliner stamp. So two-in-one, I'm guessing that means eyeliner on one side, stamp on the other, or is it two stamps? We'll have to find out. Oof. Yep, eyeliner on one side, and then the cobweb stamp on the other. Give me one second. <laughs> So if there is the cobweb stamp, how cute is that? I have one that's just a star, and I re I've seen one that's a bat that I really wanted, but I've never seen a cobweb one. That is unique. That is awesome. <laughs> I'm really excited to have that. Wow. <laughs> so far, that might be my, my favorite item, just, just from the uh, uniqueness of it. <sighs> All right. And then next we have foot clothes. Hagborn Trade Blood Cathedral. So it's just a pair of socks, with a little Blood Cathedral on them, and those are cute. And here is our very last item. Making sure going through all the paper there. Yep, we're down to the very last item. And this is by that the same company that made this little stamp, Lashy Doodle. Oh, and this is what it looks like. I'm sorry, I'm showing you the packaging. So this is the outer sleeve. And match the art matches on the actual palette. And oh, oh, ooh. And here are the colors. Now that's that's a fun palette. I really love these glitters. I hope these glitters work nicely. Oh wow, that is so pretty. I'm like afraid to touch the glitter because, you know, as soon as you do, there's glitter just everywhere. But I'm going to have to do a separate video. Oh, that's, oh, wow, that's so pretty. <laughs> I'm going to have to do a separate video trying <laughs> these eyeshadows because I don't know if you can, it's picking up on camera, but look at how cool that glitter is. <laughs> oh, wow. <sighs> Let's see here. Oh, it's like. It's like a gel, a glitter gel. I don't know if I didn't pull a bunch of it up, but if you can see, that's the orange one right there. So I can do a better, like glitter in a gel, which is probably going to be a little hard to work with. But the color is gorgeous. I don't know if you can see that. I put it in an awkward spot. <laughs> but that is such a pretty color. That is so neat. But yeah, the, uh, the glitters, when you touch them, they like... It doesn't immediately pick up on your finger. you got to kind of dig into it a little bit because it just sort of shifts around. <laughs> I don't know how else to explain it. Just sort of, I guess it's because of the gel. But, yeah, that's that's so cool. Hopefully I can make that work. I'm going to have to do a uh, get ready with me or something using this palette. So that was everything in uh, this Gothic Beauty issue number 54 uh, lifestyle box. Like I said, these are $45 a box. 
And uh, let's see here. They ha I also saw it on Crate Joy. So Crate Joy, uh, you I think on your very if you've never ordered from Crate Joy before, I think you can get a discount the first time you order from them. So you can do that possibly to get a small discount on this. So I'm going to go over uh, the information sheet now. This is Gothic Beauty Magazine 54. Features in this issue include Bibian Blue Deco Noir gowns, Julia Denise Myth Inspired Costumes and Couture, Lip Service PVC Clothing Sets in New Vampire Red, Transylvania Proposal Dark Artist Scara Darling's Mystic Trip, the style of Anne Rice Fan Club Vampire Ball, and more. Plus book reviews, music reviews, and spots on Priest, OMD, and Miss FD. And then the, uh, the items that were in here were the, the, the Blood Cathedral socks, the Lashy Doodle full-size uh, eyeshadow palette, inspired by Halloween, <laughs> the Lashy Doodle double-sided uh, eyeliner and eye stamp, the Bat Necklace, ah, eek. <laughs> The Skull Ice Cube Tray. The Lip Service Sticker and Postcard. Oh, and it has a 10% discount with the code LIPPY10. That's L-I-P-P-Y-10 in case any of you want to use that code for 10% off at lip service, lip-service.com. Never forget to put in that dash. <laughs> and then, of course, the Gothic Beauty Sticker. But it doesn't mention this random <laughs> concealer at all. So, so I guess the concealer and the uh, oil are bonus items because they are not mentioned on our little sheet. But what I want to do is I'm going to do a giveaway for the Gothic Beauty magazine itself. Um, I'm going to read it first, so it's going to be a slightly used magazine, but I'll be gentle with it. I'm not going to fold over any pages or anything, but I do want to read it first. But then I want to pass it on to one of you guys. So it's going to be a normal, one of my normal impromptu giveaway rules where it is U.S. only. I do apologize for that. Uh, well, as soon as I hit 4,000, which we're getting close to, uh, I'll be having the big giveaway that includes international giveaway. <laughs> but for right now, still U.S. only giveaway um, for this. Well, I, <laughs> once you get it, will be a gently used Gothic Beauty magazine issue 54. Uh, how to how to enter to win. Uh, of course, you have to be subscribed to my channel. You have to like this video. You have to leave a comment on this video. Then you have to go down to the description box and you have to find the Google form. And on the Google form, you'll have to give me your email address and your YouTube username. And that's just the name that shows up when you leave me a comment here on YouTube. So I can make sure you left me a comment over here on YouTube. <laughs> and I will use my random picker to pick out a winner and send you this Gothic Beauty magazine. And I'm not sure when this video is getting published, but I'll put up on the screen when I'll be taking entries too. I'll probably just do a short one, just a few days. Um, but yeah, I'm, I am really excited to read read this first before I pass it on. And yeah, Lip Service is definitely sponsoring them. Here, there's a big Lip Service ad on the back. That's so exciting. That is awesome. And I want to thank uh, uh, Zine Tastic for sending me this box to review for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought about this box down in the comments below. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Oh, and don't forget, when you're entering to win the contest, read all the rules because I didn't go over all the rules. But they're the normal ones. <laughs> they are the normal ones. Just like, must be 18 years old or older. Must be within the, must have an address within the United States I can ship to. And then all those other things I've already said. And probably a few more. So please do read them all before you enter. <laughs> and ah, where was I? So if you did enjoy my video, please give me a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy the video, of course, you can give it a thumbs down. And please tell me all about it in the comments below. And please subscribe to the channel. And I hope everyone is just staying happy, healthy, and safe in this incredibly crazy world we're living in. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.